It all began with a question, a quiet thing, a quest for knowledge, inspiring me. Too many helplessly idly wait for the heavenly, but I'll accept no suppression of my empathy. I'm here to change the world. Good evening and thank you guys for joining. Now today we don't have a derp of the day, but what we do have is a common phrase that I've been hearing, and I'm pretty sure other people have been hearing it too. I've even got a meme to go along with it. In this meme here, you can see the two stick figures, one of them saying, I don't trust scientists, they are so arrogant. They always think that they know more than everyone else. And the other stick figure asks, do you think that plumbers are arrogant because they think that they know more about plumbing than you do? He replies, no. Do you think that mechanics are arrogant because they think that they know more about cars than you do? He replies, I guess not. Then why do you think that scientists are arrogant just because they think that they know more about science than you? This is a totally legitimate question. Some people think that scientists are arrogant because they know more about science. However, every day of your life you rely on others to know more than you about a particular subject and you rely on their designs and theories. Architects that planned your home, construction workers that built it, engineers that designed your vehicle, IT experts that keep your internet experience running smoothly, and doctors that treat your ailments, just to name a few. But when it comes to cosmology and biology, the experts are absolutely arrogant, evil, and clueless. This is an extremely dismissive attitude regarding a science that allows us to have satellites in space for your cell phone functions and allows us to have vaccines against diseases that once ravaged our world. Yet here comes the average individual to tell us how the scientists are all wrong about evolution and the Big Bang, but that doesn't sound the least bit arrogant to you. Then they have the audacity to think that they can overturn nearly every field of science, including decades of rigorous study and some of the greatest minds to ever grace this earth. Next, they'll defend their position by saying, I've done my research. If you have to say you've done your research, then you probably haven't done your research. This is applicable to any field or view, including religion, but most of the time I come across this mentality or a variant of it when conversing with creationists regarding evolution. Evolution is a scientific theory which is different from the standard definition of the word theory, making it more of a fact. Actually, evolution is an observed fact. We've got over 200 years of observation of evolution, including through fossils and through observation of living things in our contemporary world. Paleontology, biology, and geology are just a few examples of fields that rely on evolutionary science. Few real scientists doubt the evidence or relevance of evolution. The beautiful thing about science is that if you truly believe that the scientists are wrong and you are willing to prove it with substantial evidence, you can actually overturn the accepted models that we have today. However, if you think that your opinion or one comment that you leave on social media is going to overturn decades of scientific understanding, then you are truly willfully ignorant. There is only one reason to deny the efficacy of evolutionary biology to explain the common dissent. You don't like it because it offends your beliefs. To quote my favorite astrophysicist and probably one of the greatest scientific minds of our time, Neil deGrasse Tyson. He says, the good thing about science is that it's true whether or not you believe in it. And science is the key to changing the world. Thank you guys for watching. I would like to give a special shout out to all my supporters over at patreon.com slash reason. If you have a burning question that you'd like me to do a video on, you can send a donation to aolistatheist at gmail.com. I hope that you all have a great day and may reason forever outweigh religious stupidity. Peace.